Hey, hey, hey. Long time no see. I want to say welcome. My name is LaShawn Terry. Welcome to the Rich Gang. We have here a um, hit or miss with Dua. Some of these labels you can barely see. Um, some will stand out like the sugar lemon, the fringe macaroon, and then some like the juicy pear you can't even see. The rise of the pink cup. Pina Colada. Anywho, this is a hit or a miss with Dua. I'm starting to go through and break down all my Duas and whatever is a miss or I think I would not um, reach for uh, will be gone out of my collection. So let's get started with this juicy pear. This is Juicy Pear. I'm not going to give, this is going to be a quick video. I'm not going to give any fragrances because all of these scents um, I go through when I first get the box. Or if I really cared about it, um, I would do a separate video with a layering and combinations. So I have Juicy Pear for a while. It has been sitting. You can see that juice. Juicy Pear to me is a miss. I don't know, it's some type of weird undertone under this. The pear is juicy, it's sweet, kind of like candy-ish, but it's just something in the background that just don't smell good. And when it dries down, it doesn't get any better. So for me, Juicy Pear is a hell no to the no, no, no. So that's a no for me on that one. Okay, Rise of the Pina Colada. When I first got this, it smells good. It smells like a pina colada. But for some reason, as it starts to dry down, it's just something weird about it. I don't know if it's the booziness. If you get any booziness, like you can smell the um, coconut, but it just doesn't have a dry down on my skin that I like. And, I tr and I've had this for a little bit too, so it has been sitting. And I've war tested it, you know, just sprayed it. You know, just to keep trying it. And it just didn't do it for me. So, um, this will most likely go to my husband. Um, it may smell on good, good to him, but it doesn't smell good to me on me at all. I don't like it on my skin. Now, pineapple, musky pineapple. I like this. This is a hit for me. You can smell the pineapple. You can smell that sweetness. And I don't get that weird undertone in the background. So musky pineapple is definitely a hit for me. Now let's get to Caribbean waters. Caribbean waters. My son is calling me, I have to call him back. Um, I like Caribbean waters. I went kind of back and forth with it. And this is unisex. Um, and I did use it. And I absolutely love it. Um, I like Caribbean waters. Again, this is unisex. Out front, you're going to get that line. Which I absolutely love. Why do you keep calling me? I just... Yeah, I absolutely love, and it gets better and better as it sits. So, Pina Col uh, Caribbean Waters is a hit for me. Then you have Sugar Lemons. Um, I like anything pretty much um, sweet citrus for the most part, and that's what you get. It's, just, it's a straight-up sweet um, lemon, kind of like... 
I want to kind of say like a zesty lemon, a zesty lemon with sugar in it. Yeah, I like it. It's like a a sweet zesty um lemon lemon. So this is definitely a hit for me. And then French macarons. I love French macarons. It's a cherry scent, but it's not giving me maraschino cherry, which I really don't like much of. Oh. But also that right hint of um bakery as well. Not too pie crusty or bready or anything like that. So French macarons is definitely a hit for me. So in in um this scent, this lineup right here, these are my hits and misses with Dua. Until the next video, stay safe. Please give me a thumbs up on the way in. Um, what do y'all think? Have y'all tried any of these scents? Did you love them? Were they misses or hits? Which one were misses or hits for you? Let me know down in the description box or the comments. And until the next video, peace.